Karan Yee Sounds in their new plugin called Polyscape Analog. Of course, we did the beat. And I'm going to show you what it sounds like. First, first thing we did was this. I just, I don't know, created something. Just, I don't know. I felt, I felt like this sound inspired me to play that. <laughs> you know what I mean? So that was the first sound. And then the second sound, we have about maybe three, three of these uh, polyscapes up right now. And of course, we have a bunch of effects just to kind of help us uh, te textualize or coloring or tone wise, you know, just, just kind of, you know, meld it to what we wanted to do. You feel what I'm saying? So this is the other one. Wait, 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 it was right here. You know, a little fun, playful vibes here. So first of all, these are the presets. I've already began to have, or begin to say presets. I have two so far that I kind of like. Right? And then, on here of course this is not what it really sounds like there is a saturate on here just the saturate is doing like ever so slightly little things in here it's, it's doing like a lfo type transient cut off so that's that's the vibe there so if i turn it turn it off so it's just it's kind of breathing now you know more so right now so this is what I wanted to do. Then this one right here. This one is bare. Nothing on there. Let's see what's going on here. Actually, I have four polyscapes. What is this doing? This one is doing nothing. Oh, it is doing something. Just got it. Okay. So that's one of my risers i just i don't know came up with something just make made that into a riser along with so inside a battery there's this marching drums that i love and i just use them you know here and there when i feel like i need them this one has transient on it kind of give me it, it just fits the mix better with this on a little widening chorus deal here and then this is a sample I took from somewhere it just helped build this section all right so So this is more like the melody right here. This is the vintage poly. I made a couple of changes in some of these as well, which is cool about this U UI here. You can, you can come in here and change things up the way you see fit. So of course I've done these polyscape review before you guys know what's going on here and they're pretty much the same so far as what i can tell the design is you know a little different you know this is more of an analog 
feel, but we have four different four different engines or well, four diff different sounds that you can choose to swap. You know, in in the presets or whatnot, you can swap them on your own, and then you click here on the mixer. You have like like sort of a first touch type deal here where you can just quickly mute something you know what i mean say like there's a sound like the overall sound of something and but there's something in there that's like whoa what is this weird i, w I wish i could turn it down or wish i can do a little bit more adjusting to that well that's what these are it's like a quick deal mute solo you could you know change the volume settings on there and then the intricate settings, the delay, the reverb is right there at your, at your fingertip. But if you want to go a little bit deeper, this is what allows you to click on, you know. And, and of course, if you click down here, same as if you click up here, it gives you those options where you can come up here and change the filter settings. You can change the LFO. You can change the stereo, the, the, the widening of the, the deal. There's a phaser. It looks like on all of them and here's your delay and reverb section right here and then you can go in and change your high pass low pass filter and then what's cool about it is that I, it was there was a couple of them that i felt like it was just too bright i just went to the master settings and there happens to be a filter located right here where i can adjust my filter settings and give it some compression if i want to and then this deal right here is kind of cool I'm not really sure like the full scope of it, but it definitely changes like the overall sound if 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 you will. So anyway, since we are talking about it, right, let's go ahead and pull it up as a separate deal. Pull keep and let's just play with it on its own. Just throw it in here and just kind of see what's happening here. All right, so So like I was saying before, like, oh, wait a second. If we come here, okay. There's like an underlying sub. I don't know if you can hear that, but let's turn it up some. So say like you didn't want that, you can just totally turn it off or you can change the octave you know what I mean So in this case, I will probably turn it off or change it to. You know what I mean? If, if, you, if you desire it, then, you know, absolutely. And then, you know, you can go to each of them and do what you got to do. You know what I'm saying? I think something like this definitely, it, it sparks creativity, you know? Okay, let's go to another preset. And then you have like the randomizer if you want to if you feel lucky that's, i feel like that's more presets because then things start randomizing You can hit the scale button it will make this plugin bigger or smaller and 
when you click down here it changes this deal to the outside where you have like this big knob let's go to another preset and see It's, it seems like this big knob, it bypasses all of the blends and give you just the sub. That's what it. So it's like a blend between the sub and. Oh, never mind. That's not what it's doing. It's actually doing something else. Yeah, I could be all day playing with this stuff. You know, I, I love. All right, so let's go to some presets. Let's see what's happening. about the soundscapes So this is what I was talking about right here. If I change it. Give it a big sound. Hmm, there's a link, but I never clicked that before. Hmm. You want a mono sound? Okay, bet. Okay, so vintage pad. I'm guessing you can also. Oh, okay, so this is how you change the individual sounds so you can do your own thing so in my case i probably would just like mute stuff first like okay let's do one at a time you know what i'm saying okay pinches pad you just go for the ones you like the best and say Okay, say so I like that. Okay, I like that. And then go here. 
change that. Let's blend that better. That's a, yeah. Kind of like that. Hmm, I like that. And then go to the next one, see see what we can bring in. Now we now we sound designed right now. Okay, that's way too much. Where's my sub? Let's bring the sub back in. That's all I have for you guys. My name is Ella. B Culture, Lifestyle Governed by Art. If you like this instrument, there's a filler link in the description area. Go ahead and grab it. Don't cost you nothing extra. I just get the points for telling you guys about it. And uh, until next time.